ಇಶಾ ಇಶಾ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಇಶಾ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನು ಆ್ಯಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಗುರುಗಳ ಜೊತೆಗೆ ತಾವು ಶಿವಂದನೆ ಆರಾಧನೆ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಆರಾಧಿಸೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಏನು ಏನು ಪ್ರಮುಖವಾಗಿ ಕಾರಣ ಸೊ ಈ ಐ ಆಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆಸ್ ಮೀ ಆಮ್ ಐ ಅ ಡಿವೋಟಿ ಆಫ್ ಶಿವ ನೋ ಐ ಆಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಶಿವ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಅ ಗಾಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಹೆಮ್ ಬಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಯೋಗಿಕ್ ಟ್ರೆಡಿಷನ್ ಹೀ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಸೀನ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಯೋಗಿ ಆದಿ ಯೋಗಿ ಈಸ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಯೋಗಿ see why would you value somebody who lived here 15000 years ago do you remember everybody no you only remember one man why somewhere he must have contributed to your life in a way that you cannot forget isn't it so his contribution is this he gave the signs of yoga yoga does not mean twisting and turning that people are doing because this is all reborn from the american coast what you are seeing today largely <laughs> yoga means it is a science which takes you beyond all limitations how to make use of yourself in the highest possible way because human life has come with a possibility we are the flower of evolution on this planet so will we blo will we blossom as flowers or will we go unblossomed this is the question to make you blossom he gave you 112 ways not as philosophy not as teaching not as belief system but as methods scientific methods as to how you can evolve this human being to honor him i put up 112 feet tall statue of adi yogi so that it will be an inspiration for people what he gave was so technically correct and scientifically correct that all these generations in 15000 years were not really ready a few people were ready and they continued that process but never the whole generation ready this is the first time that more human beings on the planet are beginning to think in a logically correct manner now simply belief system selling tickets to heaven is not going to work people want solutions they don't want uh solis or comforting words people don't want comforting words they want solution so this he offered over 15000 years ago but the tradition of yoga kept it alive waiting for that right time the right time is now because today you trust your technology more than your parents and grandparents isn't it so hello tell me are people going to their grandmothers or to the google granny <laughs> <laughs> so because your trust in technology is increased simply because you becoming more and more logically correct as the population is becoming logically thinking population now the time has come what he offered 15000 years ago the relevance of that the practical implementation of that is now and this is the first time there is enough technology we can sit here and talk to the entire world this is the very first time in the history of humanity so this is the time so i am not using adi yogi as an object of worship but as a tool to transmit as a honor for man who's offered this possibility for us so long ago which is relevant to us today you must understand yoga is the largest thing happening on the planet today over 3 billion people are practicing some form of yoga never in the history of humanity has it so happened that somebody put a sword to your throat and say do yoga otherwise i'll cut your throat never has happened but still 3 billion people are doing 15000 years tell me one more thing which has lived for 15000 years this is the only thing so it must be a, its efficacy is unquestioned but it has to be delivered properly as it's relevant for today's generation